this video, we will be showing how to connect the Renogy Wanderer 10 amp charge controller to a battery and solar panel. The Wanderer is a 10 amp PWM charger controller meant for 12 or 24 volt systems. The first step needed to set up the Wanderer is to connect it to a 12 or 24 volt battery. In this video, we will use a 12 volt battery. We will use these tray cables to make the connection. As you can see, the controller turned on once the battery was connected. The Wanderer will display seven different parameters. To cycle through the displays, press the select button. Here are the seven displays. First one is the main screen or battery voltage. Next is the solar panel voltage. Next is the charging current. Next is battery voltage. Next is load current. Next is load mode. The next step is to set the battery type. The controller can charge sealed, gel, flooded, and lithium batteries. To change the battery type, highlight the screen that shows the battery voltage. Press and hold down the enter button until the battery type screen shows up. The default setting is gel or sealed. After reaching this screen, press the select button to cycle between the four options and then press enter to save the battery type. The Wanderer is capable with the Renogy Bluetooth dongle and BT app. To connect the Bluetooth module to the Wanderer, simply connect the RJ12 cable from the Bluetooth module to the RS232 port located at the bottom of the Wanderer. The final step is to connect the solar panel. We will use this adapter kit to connect the panel to the Wanderer. This panel is for demonstration purposes only. The one we will be connecting is located outside. Once the panel is connected, the PV voltage will be shown on the Wanderer's LCD screen. This sums up our installation video. We hope this video has helped you familiarize yourself with our Wanderer 10 amp charge controller. Thank you for your purchase and have a wonderful day.